Welcome to Deutsche Math. I thought today I'll share with you a shortcut of finding LCM. Uh, as I watch my students, uh, they use this method called the tree method to uh, get the number, break it down. For example, if they're using 56, they'll do the tree of seven times eight, and eight is breaking down to two to four, and four gets breaking down two to two. Uh, this is all fine and dandy, and then they circle this, but then they get stuck from there. They don't know where to go from there. So in this shortcut, what I wanted to do is give you an analogy and then give you a story. So hopefully you can gather everything together. So let's uh, get right to it. Let's say we're finding the LCM for three numbers. We're finding for 56, and we're finding for, say, 14, and also maybe 125. Okay, it's a big number. So here's the method I want you to use. For 56, we're going to start you on uh, 7 times 8. I don't want you to do the tree. Here's the reason I don't want you to tree. Um, I want you to underline the number you're trying to break down. So 2 times 4, okay. And I want you to keep on using equal sign. The reason why I want to use keep on using equal sign is this step, this step here. Okay. From there, it's still equal to seven. You have one. Okay. Times two, and you have three times. Now it's important from here you don't make a mistake. Mistake of. 2 times 2 times 2, and you write it into 2 times 3, okay? This is not true. 2 times 2 times 2 is 8. 2 times 3 is 6. So what you want to do is actually put it into the, what I call a hat, okay? Three hats. One hat, two, three. Put the hats in there, okay? This is how I want you to break down 56. Now let's try for 14. 14 is pretty easy. It's 2 with one hat, right? There's only one of them. And seven to one hat. Let's go back, put our hat back over here. This is one hat. 125, we're gonna use the same thing. I want you to do the tree, not vertical ones. There's five times 25, okay? Underline the number you wanna break, which is 25. Five, and then after you're done breaking everything down, I want you to put the same number into the hats, okay? There's one hat, two hats, three hats. You're gonna put three here. And here is the core of LCM, okay? Um, let me go guide you over here. We have a little more space over here. So LCM for all the numbers, for the numbers we're looking for, for 56, 14, and 125 is this. I want you to literally, okay, do the minimum, minimum to make everyone Happy, okay. I'm gonna draw a happy face here. My pen is not working out today. There, okay. Here I'll explain why. What we mean by that, okay. So the LCM to make every number happen. Well, what numbers do we have? We have a seven. We want to make happy. Okay, we have a two, we want to make it happy, and we have a five, we want to make it happy. So let's put our numbers here. Seven two, and five. Now, how do we make everyone happy? I, we are going to give them as many hats they need. Okay, seven need one, because there's one hat here, okay, one hat here. We don't need it any more than one. Do the bare minimum, remember? Do the bare minimum. Number two, the number two, we have a hat of three, we have a hat of one. Well, to make it happy, we're going to have to pick, you guessed it, three. Okay, to make five happy, what do we do? There's a three. Okay, so we're gonna put a three here. So to make everyone happy, we're gonna put all the hats in there. Okay, let me find a different color. And yeah. underline this, happy. Okay, happy face means put the hats you need, the bare minimum, okay, to make everyone happy. Every one means every number, right? 
five, two, one, seven. Every unique number happened. So the, what we really want to do is I want to get you away from this tree because once you draw the tree, it's all fine and dandy, but we'll get stuck. We don't want you to get stuck. We want you to be happy. So the shortcut is to say, in order to find the least common multiple, I want you to do the minimal to make every number happy. All right? Have a confident day.